What's going on guys? Welcome back to an Icy Ramen video. Uh, before the video starts, I do want to say we are looking for more people to join this Minecraft SMP for the Naruto. So if you guys want to join, it is pay to enter. Link is in the description. It's 15 bucks to enter. There's always a bunch of people on and it is super, super fun. And uh, we've got some stuff coming to the server, so you might want to check it out. But back to the video. Uh, we have a lot of stuff to be doing. We have to learn a few different things. So Cray is gone on a mission. He left me with these water balloons. Um, he just needs a little bit more money to be able to like fund our projects because right now obviously Kato uh, Kato is no longer with us. Unfortunately, we have Kato Sharingan and Yeah, we got to figure out how to get this implanted and obviously we have like a day to get to the Akatsuki So Cray is trying to do as much as he can um, Before I have to leave I'm probably gonna have to go there without him because he's trying to get money And I think that I can be there without him anyways because he really kind of only sent for me. So we've got these water balloons. So to try to learn Rasengan in case I do need to defend myself in this situation, especially because it's going to be like 1v7 me against the Akatsuki if like if that does happen. So, you know, we we, we want to avoid that as much as possible. But basically, all I have to do is kind of concentrate my chakra into this water balloon, make the water move all around in it without bursting it. And then after that i should have another step that i have to do he said i'll figure it out once i get past the first step so i'm hoping that that's the case but uh, i'm gonna go ahead and do that guys and uh if you guys are new make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe um let's go ahead i'm gonna practice with this water balloon and i'll catch up to you guys once i have uh you know figured out how to not make it bust whenever i'm using it so i've got the rotation and movement down but I only have one water balloon left. I kept on breaking them. I have like literally nine of these broken balloons. I guess these are not worth anything anymore, um, but we do have one left. So what I have to do is work on making this more powerful. So I need to work on basically making the water move faster, but without popping it, I guess. And then after that, I'm going to head on over to that boulder over there and see if I can't uh, actually get it to work. That's that's the goal here. All right, well, uh, it was a long night, but I have good news. I did not pop the water balloon. I think that I've got it fully down. Now, my goal is to not mess this up. So, uh, I'm not going to use this water balloon. I'm going to actually try to form it in my hand as an actual Rasengan now. So, here goes nothing. Uh, come on. Come on. Oh, gosh, I did it. Okay. Okay, I didn't even need a clone like Naruto did. This this is a dub. This is a dub. So now, now what I have to do is actually see if this is powerful enough to break this rock. And it should be. So let's go ahead. Three, two, one. Nope. Okay. So, yeah, my Rasengan is not strong enough. But we can work on this. We can work on this. I'm going to hit this boulder all day with this Rasengan. Try to get better with it. And then it should be completely perfected. It's actually kind of crazy that I got it to work just from training with these water balloons. I didn't think that uh, Cray was going to be right about this, but seems like he was. So I'm going to work on making this stronger. Once I do, you guys will see, you know, what, what's left of this boulder, if anything. All right, guys. So as you can see, my Rasengan is looking a little bit different. It looks a little bit better, right? Um, And that rock, yeah. We put a decent sized hole in it. So I, I think it's safe to say that we have completed the Rasengan. And actually, this thing probably does a good amount of damage. Like, let's check this out. We got 51 damage per hit. That is insane. This only did 17.5. This is like literally triple that. So, wow. Okay, this is this is definitely a step in the right direction. If I do need something, this would be the go-to against the Akatsuki. Hopefully I don't need it. You know, obviously we've got our curse mark and everything else that we need for that, but we don't want to have to resort to that. We want to start trying to get some power elsewhere. I don't know if the curse mark is really the way to go. And I mean, definitely getting the Sharingan implanted, if that's truly what they're going to do to me, I, you know, can't trust them. They're the Akatsuki, but you know, if that does happen, then that's going to be good. So I guess I should go meet with them now. Um, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think that I'll have any trouble either escaping or at least have uh, like having my own in the fight against them. So let's go ahead. I'll meet over with them and uh, <laughs> let you guys know when I get over there. So we've made it to where I'm supposed to be. I just don't know exactly what to do to get in. I, I have my curse mark on. I figured we might as well look the part 
um you know we're, we're rolling up on the akatsuki so we've got our iron sand cloak on we've got our curse mark on uh just curse mark one because i feel like it's more intimidating slightly like yeah i don't have to go full power on you kind of bluffing a little bit but how do i get into this they said that to me to oh what what is going on welcome my hand the akatsuki hideout don't worry about how i work you in we have our uh abilities that you'll soon learn about as you join us okay um is it just me or are there more of you here than last time yeah we don't travel in our full group we have our designated missions from time to time but we wanted to welcome you here huh and then uh what about what about that big statue behind you there what what's up with that thing why does it look uh, like it's like locked up don't worry about it you're safe here. He's uh kind of the mascot of the Akatsuki, if you would say. Um I can I can tell why you uh have brought me here to teach me the Sharingan. I can I can see your eyes. Um Are you are you a part of the Uchiha clan? Long ago you could say that. But that was huh. a different time. But no worries, I see. I'm glad you finally arrived here. We'll show you the true power of the Sharing Gun and how it can help you get to the means of the end. So, our doctors will take good care of you. Follow me. Okay. I also did bring the eye with me, just in case, um, you know, in case you guys didn't have any means of getting it otherwise, which obviously you don't. Let's go ahead. Am I going in there? Of course. Um... Hmm. I, I see. You can trust me. Yeah, for sure. Trust the trust the Akatsuki that kind of came out of nowhere, randomly has a Sharingan, and um, has some type of weird statue that's locked up. So, yep. Yeah. You know what? I'll just go ahead and get in here. I'll um, be back soon with the doctors. All right. I see, man. Are you awake? Yeah, I, I feel a little bit weird. Everything's kind of looking different. How's how's my eyes look? I don't want to look yet. I'm scared to look. Good, good. It looks like the double implant worked. Du wait, double imp? I thought I only had one Sharingan. How do I have two right now? What did you do? We, ha we had an extra Sharingan. I was interested to see if both implants would work on you because of your curse mark and your Jugo plan. Seems wait. like you're healing nicely. So where did you get the other Sharingan from, though? We're a secret organization, I see. You never know what could happen. Uh huh. Oh, you okay. come out of there. Yeah, let me let me head on out of here and see what what else you got for me. So I'm gonna give you a few days to rest and obviously heal up from the implant. But there, we need to go straight into training. Obviously, as you can see, I've had the sharing on for a long time. I'll show you how to master it and become strong with it. Okay. I mean, I'm I'm definitely willing to learn. I don't know much about Genjutsu or anything like that, so it's probably going to be a decent process, but I'm sure since you're so proficient with it, um, you can maybe learn how to use it. So, yeah, let me, uh, let me go down here. I'm just going to, you know, head back out and... Um, I'll return in a couple of days then. Is that, is that okay? Let me help you a little bit. What are you going to do? Um, we... What? What? Why are we here? What just happened? Is, and it's night now? I swear that it was day. What the heck? How did I literally get all the way here? He said, he said something. He said Kamui. I don't know. I saw something in his, maybe that's some type of dojutsu ability i don't know i'm i'm literally teleported here he teleported me into the thing i don't know maybe i wonder if he's just gonna teleport me back in a couple of days i don't know how he has that power but wow okay um yeah we've got the sharingan now apparently two of them i didn't expect to have two so this is uh this is a really good this is a really good dub actually um now i guess we wait to recover from this implant and I'm guessing that I'll be Kamuid back any moment now, or, you know, any day, I guess. All right, guys, so we are on the second morning, and um, I'm feeling pretty good. I just, I'm, I'm kind of confused on what's going to happen here. He didn't tell me where to meet him. Um, There's no chance that he's going to be at the same spot, so I don't even want to try to go back there. Uh, he said that they move frequently, so 
I don't even know how he's gonna get me there, but uh, yeah, we're gonna we're just gonna I guess oh oh uh I guess I'm here. Thanks for joining me, Icy. You're finally what? here, I guess. What just happened? How am I here? Uh, my Sharingan ability. Soon, soon you'll see the full power of the Ichiha clan. Yeah, I don't understand how you keep teleporting me here. It kind of doesn't make any sense, but, um, yeah, I mean, I guess if you, uh, I guess if you know what you're doing with the Sharingan, I guess it's a lot of potential then, huh? Indeed. We're here. Actually, do you know why we're here? No idea. I don't even know where we're at. You're going to test the capabilities of your Sharon gun and how much dexterity it gives you. Okay. I didn't know that this gave you dexterity as well. It gives you the ability to see what other people cannot see. It's almost like future sight, if you would say. Okay. Oh, uh, so how am I uh how is how is this gonna work here? Kamui. This Kamui ability is crazy. Why did you just put me in a pit of lava? You're not funny. <laughs> What I want you to do, I see, is use the Sharingan. See the points that you need to go to to get up here. Okay. And so you're saying that this should also... Oh. But yeah, I guess it, this does actually make me a lot faster, huh? Oh, Indeed. wow. This is, this is crazy. Okay. Okay, hold on. I might be... This is easy. I can literally see exactly where I need to go. It's almost like I, I'm, like, thinking ahead of what I need to do. It's... What the... It's like my body's just moving. You need to learn how to master this ability. This ability will help you in the future when you're fighting others. I can literally see each path of each perfect jump. I feel like, is there only one correct way up here? There is only one correct way. It's just like I know it. The power of the Sharingan is vast and it's never ending. The secrets are only tied to your ability to learn. Okay. Um. Boom, there we go. Yeah, literally every jump I make is working. This is crazy. Okay, okay. I literally made it all the way back up here with like, I, I only messed up I think once and that's not too bad for just getting the Sharingan, huh? Without the Sharingan, you would have to use your curse mark abilities to get out of that hole. True, true, okay. Well, that's no. honestly good, but what's so what's the battle use of the Sharingan? Is there anything that I can like, I know when Kato used it in battle, it, it seemed like he was able to like damage people with it almost. How am I, how am I going to be able to do that? I mean, it's just an eye. I don't understand how you can damage somebody with it. The Sharingan deeps into someone's soul. It's the strongest genjutsu that you can cast on people. You'll be okay. a cut above everybody else when it comes to genjutsu. If you're able to master the, uh, the doji. Okay, do so how do I is, do that? What we're gonna do next is you're gonna battle well, not per se me, but a clone. Let's see okay. how you do against another Sharingan user. I shall inflict Genjutsu abilities on you, and we'll see if you can't overcome it with your own ocular abilities. Huh. Okay. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and do that. But first, I I need a I need a quick break for a second, um, Mr. Akatsuki man. I'll, where, where should I meet you? Or I guess you'll just teleport me there anyways, huh? You're learning. All right, I'll be. I'll, you know, I'll see you when you teleport me. I gotta. I just need a breather for a second. All right. Um. Yeah, guys. So I noticed something. Um. I don't know if you guys noticed what I was zooming in on there. But uh, this is all kind of starting to add up. He has the Sharingan. And he's mastered it. He had spare Sharingans. And he has some type of crazy abilities with it. I don't know. But what I zoomed in on was, in fact, the bottom of his cloak. Did you guys notice what I was zooming in on? It's the same as the cloak that I'm wearing, aka the same as the village that Kato came from when I first met him. I don't know if it's Kato or if maybe he has some ties to him because they're both Uchiha, but something's not adding up. I don't quite get what's going on here, but I'm, I think I'm on to something here. I, I don't know. This is really weird. I, I saw Kato die with my own eyes though, so it can't be him. It's gotta be, 
it's got to be somebody else. And Kato also said they had no idea about the masked man that was by the sand, the sand village with the Shikaku. I don't, I don't know. Nothing's making sense. I'll get to the bottom of this though eventually. Well, uh, it's been a day and he hasn't Kamuied me. I think that's what he calls the ability. So I guess I'm, ru oh, and there he is. Um, hello. Uh, how's it going? Did the rest you wanted? I did, I did, and I, um, I'm feeling pretty good. I feel really fast, actually, just running around. I'm feeling pretty good. I think that I'm getting more proficient with this eye as time goes on. That's good. Today, we're going to do training. I've decided not to put my clones against you, but me and you shall spar. Okay. Um, are you sure that that's safe? Far... Of course. I won't hurt you. I want to mm -hmm. see how far you can take your Genjutsu abilities. Okay, um, I don't quite have any Genjutsu abilities yet, but I do have something new. I, you know, I don't know if I should exactly be showing you this, but, uh, Rasengan. That's an ability used by the old Hokage. Mm-hmm. I see. I see that it won't help you against me this time. This time? What do you mean by that? I'm going to show you. The true power of the starring gun, Genjutsu, Tsukiyomi. What? What is this? Am I in a Genjutsu? What? Wait, why are there so many dead Kato's around? Kato, wait, why am? Why did he teleport me here? And how does he know about this? What? This is exactly how Kato died. How? How? How am I here? What is this place? Welcome to the Tsukiyomi world. This is where. You experience the worst of the worst in your life. The worst events, and you relive them over and over again. That's true. I mean, yeah, I guess Kato was the one who pretty much took me in under his wing and protected me and was going to help me defeat Orochimaru, which, by the way, when are we going to go take him out? That's, that's the whole reason that I accepted to, you know, be with you guys. After I learned this, you know, whatever Sharingan moves you're going to teach me, can we do that? Because I'm pretty sure that I'm ready. I mean, I feel I feel pretty good right now. Show me that you're prepared. Show me that you're ready to take Orochimaru to the next level. Okay, I, I can do my best. So when are we, are we just going to fight then? Oh, okay. Yep, I guess so. I guess so. All right, a little quick spar match inside of a Genjutsu. This has to be some type of really strong Genjutsu. I didn't think that this was possible. I thought if you were in a Genjutsu, that's pretty much you're just stuck there. Nothing bad can happen, but I guess I was very wrong, huh? You need to reach into yourself and learn how to use your ocular abilities to escape this. Okay. Only then will you be able to leave this place. Okay, so wait, am I am I supposed to be looking for hints in here? Similar, yes. Okay. Find yourself, and then you can dis dissipate this Genjutsu from yourself. Hmm... Okay, well, I guess let's let's continue the fight for now. What? Wait, wait, what? His Akatsuki cloak is gone. Hold on. Maybe, maybe I'm troubled by this whole thing. Maybe what? It's back on. Now it's wait. I have to be troubled by this whole thing. Something's something's bothering me about the whole situation that I've been in. I gotta figure this out. So if he's losing his cloak, looking like Kato almost. It means, yeah, his cloak's back on now. It's almost like I'm worried that it's him, but it's, there's no way that it is. So hold on, hold on. I might know what I need to do. I need to find one of Kato's dead bodies in here and I need to give back what I don't feel like is righteously mine. So I think that that should release this Genjutsu. Oh, okay. Okay, I gotta make this fast. I gotta make this fast. Uh, take your eye back. Oh, it worked. Okay, wait a minute. I can't believe that that actually worked. Wait, I'm scared to look. There's no way that I actually lost my Sharingan, right? Because I was in a Genjutsu. Okay, yeah, no, I didn't lose my Sharingan. Okay, okay, we're good. Now, where's this? What? Bro, how are you here? Good job, Icy. I'm proud of you. I had, I basically, so, <laughs> am I right in thinking this? I had to basically face facts with what, I was troubled with inside of my own mind. Is that is that kind of what this whole point was about? 
you need, you need to take control of your own emotion. Hatred is the power of the Uchiha. When you're able to harness that and control that, anything is possible. Okay. I mean, yeah, that that makes sense because isn't the way that usually if you know if you're not lucky like me and got implanted isn't the way that you unlock your sharingan through like emotional pain or something like that okay you have to understand that kato is gone you have no mentor anymore uh -huh. the, is the, the family that you have now okay for sure yeah i mean it's it's weird. Were you were you actually in my head with me or was that just me fighting myself? What do you think? I don't know. I really don't know. But I think you need to start asking yourself those questions, I see if you want to grow stronger. Exactly. So this this move, how do I should I have some type of ability from from doing all that or or what's what's the deal with that? So the way that you have unlock the Sharingan is not normal, right? Right. But going through Genjutsus and learning how that works should allow you to unlock a certain ability called Shackling State, which okay. is basically a move that should be able to paralyze your opponent. A uh, paralyze? That sounds a lot like a move that Kato used to use a lot. Um, the Shackling Stakes, does it, does it paralyze and damage them? I mean... Oh, wait, I have it. Okay, uh, is this... This has to be it, the Shackling Sticks. Yes, it is. Okay, so it's a, it's a Genjutsu that it, they get put into an illusionary world, damaging them through illusionary spikes entering their body. That that sounds fun. Um, Go ahead. Uh, oh, it seems like I need to train a little bit more with my eyes. Oh, you're not strong enough yet, I see. Yeah, I need to actually put some points into Genjutsu and train it. I guess... So maybe if I keep practicing this move, will that will that do it for me? I think with this ability, along with your curse mark and the new rust hang gun that you learned, you might be actually ready to take a road tomorrow. I shall be your partner on this mission. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna work on getting this shackling stakes right. I'm gonna train up with it. I can't use it yet, but I'm I'm a step in the right direction. So. uh Thank you, Mr. Mysterious Mass Man. I'm going to go ahead and uh, rest up a little bit, and then I'll, you know, I think that I'll be able to find you this time when, I, when I'm ready to fight Orochimaru. Sounds good, Icy. I'll see you soon. All right. Oh, and he's gone. Okay. Um, yeah, so I kind of, I don't know how to feel about all this, guys. Um, it was kind of weird that Tsukiyomi place or whatever he said that it was, and then he asked me if he was there or really not there or if it was just in my head. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if he is trying to just get me to unlock more things or is messing with my head so I can't, like, keep things straight. I mean, if, you know, it's the Akatsuki. They're going to try to manipulate me as much as they can, you know, whether whether they say that or not. I know that's what they're doing. So at least we unlocked the Sharingan. We got Shackling Stakes almost. At the start of next episode, we should have it fully mastered. I just gotta, you know, get my Genjutsu up, and then um, I should be able to take on Orochimaru. And he did say that he would be my partner on this mission, so I'm honestly kind of interested in seeing how this guy fights and, you know, seeing if it's similar to how Kato fought it all. But, guys, if you liked that video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Uh, we do a lot of these Living World videos, so, um, you know, definitely stick around if you like them. And if you guys want to join the server and potentially be in a video, go ahead and check out the description. It's only $15 to enter. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I see you guys on here. Everyone have a great rest of your day or night, whatever it is for you. Peace.